Hi, this is Darren from App Radar. Welcome to this video. And today I'm going to be doing a review and demo on the software called Write Cream. Now, Write Cream is another AI copywriting tool that's been doing the laps. And um, I thought I'd go and check it out um, and see if it's any good so I could basically do a review on the channel um, and show you guys exactly what it can do and whether it's really worth investing in. Now, what I'm going to do with this um demonstration itself is i'm going to be basing it purely on the long form editor i'm going to do a longer demonstration and a longer tutorial um and i'll be linking that in the description below um when i've actually recorded that which will be in a day or two's time and the reason why that is is because there's an awful lot of tools in here um and it's really going to be too much just to do like one review and one demo on it i'd rather do an extended demo so i can break it down step by step they are actually running a lifetime deal at the moment in time, which I've linked in the description below. Um, I think you can get a lifetime deal, I think, for $59 at this moment in time, which, in my opinion, is an absolute steal. With that said, I'm going to get straight into it. Now, I've kind of prepared a few things, and again, I'm not going to go into everything in great depth in this. I'm just going to show you how quickly you can actually write a blog post, okay? Um, and what I thought I'd do is I'd like to do a bit of a timing. So I'm going to kind of show you the document that I've pre-prepared. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to base it on as if I was going to do um, an affiliate blog post for Elementor, okay? And um, I'll basically show you why I've done this. So we're going to the long form editor. Mm. Now, what it's going to do, um, you're going to build your idea first, okay? So you're going to put a brand name, or this will either be your keyword or your brand name, and then your product description, okay? So what you do, um, obviously, I've done Elementor, so that is a brand name and kind of like a keyword. And I've done a description here. And what you're kind of doing there is you're putting like, oh, like the other keywords in there. So if, you, if you're familiar with Jasper, what you'll do, you'll put as much information in um, in the start of it as you possibly can, and then Jasper will then build um, your blog post upon that information, and that's what this is doing, okay? So I'm going to move that off screen to make it easier for me to do. So we're going to go from blog idea, and what I'm going to do is um, I'm going to start a stopwatch, okay, just to sort of see roughly how long it takes to build out this um blog post so we're going to do blog idea and we're going to base it on elemental and uh we're going to put the description in so we're going to keep it as casual and stuff like that we'll do it really as quick as we can we're not going to be worrying too much about what you know what it's going to be doing and we're not going to read through it all we're just going to let it do what it needs to do so basically what it's done first is it is um spat out some of the blog ideas okay so that's really what it's going to give us so obviously we've got like um lists we've also got obviously like different things so what i'm going to do i'm just going to take one of these okay now what you have to do again i'm not going to explain too much but you have to put it in a different document i'll explain that in like the later video what we're then going to do from here we're going to do blog idea and we're going to go blog intro we're going to build an intro from the information that we've already got in there so you can click on right for me and it's kind of giving us four like different intros. So I'm just going to take the first one. And again, what I would recommend that you do is you're going to obviously read through these and make sure it fits what it is that you want to do. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to take, so that um, this what I got from there, we're then going to put into where it says blog topic. We're then going to put that in there. And you're going to go to blog outline. And then you're going to click right for me again. What that's then going to do, that's going to write the blog, um, the blog outlines on that particular heading. Okay. So I'm going to have a quick read through these. So some of those, some of those, I mean, that's kind of like saying how to style pages and stuff. So that's probably going to be based on Elementor. This one's more specifically Elementor. That's not really anything to do with Elementor, nor is that okay. So it's not really giving us, it's giving us two really good outlines and then two that probably aren't quite on point. But I'm going to take those ones because that's all based on Elementor itself. And I'm going to put them in my document, okay. 
So basically, that's what I'm doing, okay? I'm just putting it all in the document to build it out. What I'm going to do, I'm going to pause the video, but I'm going to keep the timer running, okay? So we can see what's going on. So what I want to do is I'm going to format all these. So I'm going to take all of these, these, you know, these numbers out and stuff like that, format it all, um, so we can actually start building the blog out. Okay, so basically all I've done is I've just, you know, um, I'll spread it all out and whatnot, so it kind of like makes more sense as I'm building this thing out. So now what we're going to do, we're going to build it out, okay? So we're going to go from there. We're going to do um, like the blog heading expander. And what that's going to do, we're going to take each one of the um, the H2s that we've created and expand on them, okay? So I just bring up my document again, and we'll start going there. And you basically leave all this as it is, um, and you put it in the section headline. And uh, you're going to do right for me. <clears throat> So that basically gives us like you know three or four of the um expansion okay i'm just going to take this second one here and i'm going to add it into my document so just to kind of show you what i'm doing okay so i'll put that in there and i'm going to take the next one closest down Come right for me. So you can see how quick it's actually, you know, generating the content as well. It is really quick. I'm going to take that one there. So you can basically see what I'm doing. So what I'll do, I'll pause the video, but I'm going to keep everything running on. Um, On here, so we're basically at seven minutes at the moment, sort of thing. Okay, so I'll go back to here. And what I'll do is I'll do all of those, um, the H2s, move them all across to sort of save time on the video itself. Okay, so I've just gone through um, and filled all that out now. Okay, um, so obviously I just split those apart, took all of the, um, the H2s, and uh, I've not actually done that one there. So I'll do that one more. But I've basically taken all the H2s and uh, I've basically fleshed it out. Okay, so obviously what it's going to do is, uh, you know, give me all of my content. I'll just put that in. So obviously what I've done, okay, is I've just pushed the buttons. I've let it do what it needs to do. I've copy and pasted what it's given me and put it into this document. Okay, so I've not checked it. Is it SEO friendly or all that kind of business? Probably not. Um, but it's just kind of showing you exactly how the machine works and, and really what it can do. Um, but what I would highly recommend that you do is you build your own blog outline, um, do your own research and obviously make sure that all the content that it's giving you is on point with what it should be, okay? But again, this is just purely like a demonstration um, of exactly what it can do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take that part out because we don't need that. And I'm going to show you roughly how many words it's generated for us. So I'll do copy that. Go here. So on 11 minutes now. So obviously when I paused, it was about eight minutes. We'll go into word count and we'll drop that in. Um, and it's like a 1244, um, you know, word blog post um, within whatever it was, 11 minutes. And obviously some of that was like messing about talking with the camera. So probably, you know, in, in time scales, it's probably talking around about eight minutes to do that. So that really shows you how powerful um, right cream actually is. Again, like I say, it, it's really important that when you're using these tools that you remember that it's a writing assistant, it's not a writer, okay? So the information that you give it is going to be, you know, the quality of the information that it, that it gives you will be the quality information that you give it, basically. That's what I'm trying to say. Um, so if you just, you know, do what I did there, it spits out the content. It probably won't make a great deal of sense, but if you sort of check it and make sure everything's right, it's going to be on point. It really is a really good bit of kit. So that's basically it, okay? That is that is right cream in a nutshell. It's a really good bit of kit. I think it's well worth the money on the lifetime deal at this moment in time. So uh, take care. Thanks for watching, and uh, I'll speak to you again in another video.